Valley. So fog can cause some slowdowns in your first alert forecast. Also a good reminder for the kids standing around at the bus stop where there is that fog. They want to make sure that they're up in the grass. Right? There may be some visibility issues for some of those drivers. So definitely that extra note of caution here as we start the day off. Those temperatures nice and mild. A lot of low to mid 60s. The fog also acts like a little bit of a patchy blanket. Temperatures don't budge much as we sit here and just keep pumping out this fog for the first few hours of the day. Really, it takes a couple hours of the sun coming up to start to burn off that fog to actually evaporate that moisture in the air. So that's where we'll see more of an improvement between 9, 10 to 11 a.m. And then lots of sunshine midday. The first couple of specks of rain trying to pop up here, mainly in the mountains around 1 to 2. Notice a little stray pop up trying to develop along the plateau as well. Could try to slide down from the plateau into the valley, but we are limited to more of a 10% coverage of our area at best and some rain and storms. Notice in the evening that a couple try to roll down into parts of Roan and Anderson and Knox counties. Still sticking with more of a 10% coverage to start the night. We do see a couple more while you're sleeping tonight, but still pretty spotty on those rain and storms for tonight before more move this way. So tomorrow's the day that we'll start to see more rain and storms move in. That is that cold front that is on the way. So out ahead of it, we have a chance to warm up, which is important in case you want to get outside on the warmer side of this week. The rest of the week is going to run a little chilly. So it's 65 to start with those areas of fog. 78 at noon with your high today of 87. We'll be in the upper 70s at 8 o'clock just after sunset. So for today in that forecast where you live, hoping to get outside and enjoy, those temperatures range from low to upper 80s today. Zooming in so you can find your county. That's 88 Athens to Loudoun, 87 Knoxville to Oak Ridge. You're looking at a forecast high today of 85 Rockwood, 81 Jamestown, 82 in Oneida. Aimed at 84 for your high today, La Follette to 82 in Williamsburg and Middlesbrough. Forecast where you have heats up to 83 in Morristown, to 86 Pigeon Forge, and 84 in Newport. Now for tomorrow, we're still warm, but then we're cranking out some scattered storms too. So that becomes that transition point here ahead of the front. Spotty to scattered rain and storms. Spotty in the morning, scattered afternoon to evening. That'll be 80 at noon tomorrow with a high of 86. Then more on and off rain and storms into tomorrow night. Let me show you how it looks on that first alert future cast. As you can see, a few already moving around in the morning. Some layers of clouds here, kind of a mix of sun and clouds midday, and then more scattered rain and storms coming up about the time the kids are getting out of school. Tuesday into parts of the valley. Here comes another batch coming along the plateau. So a little hit or miss downpours and storms, about a 40% coverage of our area tomorrow afternoon and evening. That slides on through early tomorrow night. That'll slide it down to more of a spotty coverage by Wednesday. But that'll also be when those temperatures start to take a hit. So we're starting to collect more of that scattered coverage in some rain and storms with some of those downpours here adding up to about a half an inch in parts of our area. But then it adds up to only a couple more showers and storms on Wednesday afternoon. You can see that passage here as the winds shift. So this is where we go to spotty rain and storms and temperatures in the 70s starting in Wednesday. Then we can enjoy more of those 70s really to end the week, especially with some mornings in the 50s, Thursday and Friday. Below average temperatures will continue through the end of the week. Now we are looking at some more scattered rain at times, both Saturday and Sunday afternoons. If you're looking ahead to next weekend.